Hello, it's Lana here from the Information Lab in London. In this video, I'll be going over the new 2020.3 feature, Clear Setting on Parameter Actions. Let's take a look at this viz. Here we have a reference line of 30,000. It also colours whether it's above or below that reference line. So let's say I wanted to click on this mark of 81,777 update that reference line to see what was above or below. But then when I clear select off of it, I want it to reset to 30,000. Okay, so I go to worksheet actions or dashboard actions, depending on where you are. Add action, change parameter. So we're going to do it on the select to our sales from the sum of sales. And this new section here, which is clearing the selection, will either keep the current value you have selected or set a new value. So I'm going to change this to 30,000. I'm going to call it my sales action. I'm going to hit OK. Now when I do this, I'm going to select this bar, which is now 38,000. So I will click it. It will update and show you everything that's above or below that particular reference line. And then when I click off, it'll automatically go back to 30,000. Once again, if I click another bar, which is 34,000, it will update and drop back down. You can also do the same with dates. So here we have a previous example with a month set at the 1st of July. If 1st of July 2020. So if I go to worksheet, actions, add action, change parameter. Again, month parameter, this time the month of order date. I'm just going to call this our date parameter. And I'm going to say change it to always set back to the 1st of the 1st 2020. So I'm going to hit OK and hit OK again. So now when I select December 2018, it will change the line to show that point. But then when I click off, it will go to the 1st of January 2020. Once again, click a point. Selecting off it will clear that selection. For the old value, if I go to Worksheet, Actions, Date Parameter, and Edit, if I keep current value and hit OK. What this is going to do is now if I select November 2018, when I deselect the mark, it will keep that specific parameter as the value I selected. So once again, I'll select December 2019. It will update and I can click off and it will remain the same. If you like this video, please subscribe to the channel and check out the feature release playlist for more awesome features.